So this is the floor that I'm gonna start on. It's at the very top, not much traffic. That's why we are gonna go ahead and put this down versus the other floors that we don't want to get tore up. So we're gonna hold off on them for a while. But typically whenever I'm laying a floor, it's just that LVP and I will run it up against a wall or use a wall as kind of like my starter to get a straight line. And I'll measure over, you know, just to make sure that it's not gonna end up with a real small piece on the very end on the other room. But up here, you see, uh, there's all kinds of walls I can go off of. <laughs> so what I think I'm gonna do is I'll run the planks like this. So whenever you walk up, instead of like that, and I think it'll flow with the vertical cedar a lot better as well. But I'm going to act like this wall is straight. So I'm going to pull from that line over on both ends of it, and I'll get me a chalk line right up here. So it should start up here. I'll have to cut out this first piece a little bit, and then it'll run straight through over there. Then I will lay all the floor this way, but I will have to back lay this little area here, which won't be terrible. So that's kind of the rundown about what I've came up with on the best way to do this floor. So I'm gonna go get that line chalked and get the floor ready. So here's how I'm gonna get this line here. On this first piece, I don't want this edge right here to line up with this. I really need this to slide up all the way up here so then i've got a cut edge here a little bit of a cut edge here and then i'll have an angled cut right here so how i'm going to do that is i've got this four foot level that's underneath this i just pulled this out to get the width of it so i knew how close i had to be i've got a little bit of wiggle room but this is just to give me a general idea and get me out to this wall so now i'm able to pull a measurement from there and get to where I about want the edge of my piece. So that's what I'm gonna do to get a point up here and then also a point down here. Then I'll go ahead and measure over, get me a line here that's even with this wall and then run it the rest of the way. Well guys, I got pulled off of doing this floor yesterday to go take care of some other business, but it is the next day and we're back here at the castle i don't know if i showed you guys in the last clip but i got my line chalked here and everything should work out good i've got my cousin easton he's going to be helping us get this floor down today so that being said um we're going to go ahead and start this first row right here and once i get it started and everything in place i'll explain to you guys uh, exactly how I'm doing it and I'm gonna show you guys. All right, so I got this first piece cut and installed. Then I followed out my line, my chalk line. What I did was with the all fall of this piece, I went ahead and cut it. So now this is stable and it's not gonna move. I screwed it down. That's obviously just temporary until we lay far enough out and probably go ahead and lay all the way out then we'll come back in here and we'll have to back lay this so you gotta kind of get the process i think so i'm gonna put you guys on time lapse and me and easton are gonna get this thing knocked out pretty quick just gonna give you guys a heads up here this is gonna be a lot of time lapse this stuff's pretty simple so it's the same process over and over again Maybe in my next video that I lay the floor, I'll uh, really sit there and show you guys the process of it. But for this video, just a lot of time lapse. And this was my cousin's first time laying this floor, so I was trying to teach and keep him going at the same time. So it took a little bit longer than what I expected, but it was a good learning process.
Well guys, that will wrap it up for this video. It turned out awesome. Thanks Easton for helping me out. So now we just have to do this one and a lot more flooring. So hope you guys like the time lapse of me putting this floor down because you guys are probably going to be seeing a lot of it. So if you guys haven't, make sure you guys are subscribed and share away.